Look, guys, I'm aware of the fact that, yeah, defense is rough, but 3-5 wide is everywhere, and I want to just throw in my two cents in the whole debate, and I think that this play actually, it actually does a good job of containing some of the plays that people like to run out of Gumba Jostet. I'm going to be honest with you. The play that I'm, of course, talking about is... Cover no, it's not cover three bus. It's Mike Blitz three. Yes, this is the play that we've seen all last year. It's all coming back again to haunt us in our dreams. We're gonna call this play, and our offense is just coming in double post. Now, I hate this because it's the same thing we had last year. But that's what you gotta do if you wanna win. So what you do with this is you pinch the entire defense, which is R one. Down on the left stick. There you go. Just learn some. Pinch the entire defense. What that does is it pinches the defensive line, the linebackers, and it also presses these guys. Now, if you guys don't know, there is an issue where cover three just gets lobbed. If a, if, a, if there's a fade on Devontae Adams right here, I can run that. I can throw a lob pass. It'll, get, it'll be caught. All right. That's an issue. So we're going to move this guy back. That's the first thing we do. So I come off the huddle. Pinch the entire defense. Boom. Click over there. Script. And get him back. Sorry. I'm never going to do that again. Okay. Then the play looks like this. What we will then do is shade up twice. Uh, shade up. Slant to the outside twice. Can I do that? No, I can't. Oh. It doesn't show the. It doesn't show the frigging adjustment. So as I was saying, you guys, we're gonna come out of the huddle. We're gonna pinch the entire defense. We're gonna put, put this guy back right there. We're gonna slant, uh, slant our D line to the outside twice. So it looks like this. I'm gonna take Warner, put him in this gap. It's important you put him opposite the running back. This works against not just gun bunch. But against pretty much every other shotgun formation. And then you're going to QB contain. Alright, that's how it's going to look. Now, what I haven't told you yet is you need zone drops for the curl flats to be on 5 yards. Or your hard flats on 5 yards. And then you just put hard flats on field. Now, that's what I'll do because you can't... I don't know why he did this. You can't adjust zone drops in practice mode. It's the dumbest thing ever. But we're going to have to live with it. Just pretend that those are curl flats on the outside at 5 yards. Okay, got that. So now I'm going to snap this ball and you will see how we can one controller. You can see how we can get in pretty easily. Oh my god, it didn't just get we just didn't get we just didn't get any pressure at all. Let's try it again. That looked so bad. So we're gonna do this again. Boom, 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 boom. There you go, blitz is set up. I'm gonna send everybody out on a route, and now you can see, yeah, that's better. That's better. So what you all you have to do, I'm gonna do this really slowly again. Pinch the defense. Slant to the outside twice, just like that. Then take this guy, move him back so we don't get bombed. QB contain and stand in this gap. Now you can get a little bit closer. I'll just be careful to not get an encroachment. Now, there you go. I'm gonna block a running back now to show you that this even gets in against the blocked running back. And this is stupid because this is just a great blitz. And you'll we'll watch this in replay. I don't know what just happened. I really don't. Let's let's just watch this though because I think this is really funny. I mean, I know what happened, but I don't know why it happened. So we're gonna look at the running back and this guy right here. So this guy and the running back. That's not the running back. That's the tackle. That's the running back. Okay, snap this ball. Boom, 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 boom. What? He just thumbs him out. Just just runs right by him. I mean, we got six rushes versus six blockers. Everybody should get picked up. I mean, if somebody sheds, then somebody sheds. I used to get picked up. So I don't know what's going on there. Was was that a fluke? Let's let's try it again. Why not? The running back is blocked. Gonna set the blitz up again. Boom, 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 boom. Real, real cool. Uh huh. There you go. Blitz is set up. Running back is blocked. Snap the ball, and you will see. Same thing happening right there. He touched him. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Just still got by him. One more time, because I. I, I I just think it's so much fun. I think that it, this is so much fun. Now, there are, of course, ways you can get around this. You can just snap the ball. Uh, just uh, throw the ball real quickly after the snap. Or there is a way to block this in my new ebook available on jtips.net. You saw it in the intro. Yeah, go do that. Go purchase that ebook if you want to block this. This is the only thing that I've ever seen get close to blitzing on my shots. I'm going to be honest with you. This is the only thing that people have ran on me and where it's like, I have a little bit of an issue with not not too much because come on job set is insane this year and you should definitely get my ebook have I haven't mentioned that yet okay that's why let's, let's just stop this is set up uh, once again there we go running back is blocked one last time I want to show this to you and then boom 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 gonna drop back yeah I mean it takes for him it takes a while for him to loop all the way around 
But once he gets there, man oh man, he's, he's a threat to be reckoned with now. Let's try this out of some other place because we can set up the same concept out of some other coverages. Let's just call cover for show two, which as we all know is cover for match. Cover for match. Yeah, pretty good this year. Let me be honest, pretty good. Gonna pinch the entire defense, slam to the outside twice, blitz all linebackers, QB contain. There you go. Now we're gonna once again block the running back. Yes, we're gonna block him right there. Boom, cool, 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 cool. Just loop around them. <laughs> Just loop around them, and the coverage is there because cover for match is awesome as well. Cover for match, if your opponent doesn't expect it, <laughs> you're gonna have a good time on defense. Snap this ball one more time because it's just so much fun to watch this guy loop around. And let's not forget, he only sending five people. I mean, only to some people, only play covers, saying three people. That might sound like a lot. Five people, that's a lot of people. To get consistent pressure like this, when you have your user just hugging the gap and then going back, using crazy stuff. That's a good blitz, you guys. That's a really, really good blitz. It might not sound like it, but pressure like this, five versus six, that's rare. And also, it's consistent. That's the that's the best thing. A consistent blitz, five versus six blockers, that's worth gold this year. Because coverage just isn't that good. If you're just running pure coverage, the zones are going to break down. They're not going to break down within three seconds of me getting to the quarterback. So one more time, I'm going to do this exact same thing. You can also move him back. I've not gotten bombed as much. I've covered for a match. But you can do it, of course. I just, I just love seeing this. I just, I just love it. You think he's there. This one is actually particularly egregious, and I want to I want to point this out. This is really wild to me. I mean, he's there. Sorry, my voice is getting a little bit screechy. But he's there. How? How does that happen? He, he He's there. This blitz, it's so annoying to deal with, because if you don't know what to, you need to specifically do it, on specific adjustment, if you don't know that adjustment, which is, of course, needed, then you're gonna struggle. <laughs> you're gonna struggle so much. And this is really where you're gonna. You're just gonna beat everybody running bunch who doesn't know what they're doing. It's, it's, it's just that simple. And when you can do that by just running one simple blitz, you're gonna have a good time. Now, pretty much everything that I do on defense is based on this look. I pinch the defense every time I move this guy back on the outside. And then I put this guy in the. And it looks like I'm sending a little bit. But guess what? I'm dropping in the coverage. It doesn't show it any, actually, but. Okay, there, there it is. I'm dropping into coverage. You're blocking everybody. Thinking that, okay, you're sending a blitz. <laughs> I might just fool you. If you max protect right there, everything is covered. Yeah, <laughs> that's how it goes sometimes. So, just because the threat of running that blitz is there, you're going to make a lot of people really struggle blocking it. And just the mind games in this are impeccable. You might just force them to max protect for a play. And if they don't have anything open for a play, that's win for the defense. And just keep them on their toes. Fake them out. Okay, well, he just ran coverage last time. Oh my god, now I'm saying it's that quickly. I absolutely love this blitz because it's so versatile, too. You can do this of any coverage. The blitz setup is the same, it works just as well of any play. And you can just fake him out. That's the best thing about it, in my opinion. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know defense, it's rough this year. I mean, I'm playing this game, I understand the way that it's set up. But this will this this will help at least a little bit, right? Just a little bit. If and if you learn something, subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. It would help so much. I'm out though. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I'll be happy to respond to as many as I can. Which is usually all. Because I'm young. And got free time. Like I'm quick with the Twitter fingers. So until next time, goodbye guys. Tomorrow I'll see you with another one of those. Love y'all.